There are fire watches everywhere in California, and so we're right in the literally like a line of fire. Yeah. Life is always up you guys it is Zach and Ash and we are bringing you a brand new video so today we are gonna go to Walmart to get a futon for our living room because we have a really small living room and that'll fit perfect in there so we're gonna go get a futon what else are we gonna do what else you want to do baby it's your birthday happy birthday oh yeah it's my birthday I keep forgetting so I'm 27 today 27 yeah, uh, Arna? I thought you were like 21, baby. Oh, thank you. So we got this big old futon. <laughs> takes up the whole back takes seat. Takes up literally the whole entire back seat. And I'm out of breath because I had to run over there, take the buggy to the buggy return. I officially got the futon done. Check it out. Uh, now, we are about to go get groceries. I am going to get Ashley a good birthday dinner. So we're gonna get something good and I'm gonna cook for her for her birthday. And if you wanna know why we're always wearing the same outfits, whenever we moved, we had to sell all of our clothes. So, I'm working with five shirts right now. Yeah, we don't have so any once we have jobs, we'll go get some more clothes. So if it looks like we're wearing the same clothes over and over and over, we are. But pretty much, but they're clean. <laughs> they're clean. We wash them. It's just we only have five different shirts and yep. a couple pairs of jeans. Uh -huh. Just let y'all know, FYI, my mom said something to me the other day. So gotta let y'all know. We just got done cooking for Ashley's birthday dinner. You wanna hold it, babe? Yeah. yeah. We got steak. Macaroni, asparagus, and sushi because we love sushi so much. It looks this looks so good. amazing. All right, guys, we're gonna eat this and then sleep. being a food coma, I'm probably gonna sleep and we'll get back with y'all tomorrow. I know I'll probably look goofy with my helmet on, but I'm going for a little bike ride in this little park we got here. It's got a big old lake. It is so beautiful here. Ashley's right here, but she forgot the camera, so I rode over here to meet her so that we could go around this loop de loop. And I'm gonna take her the camera so she can show you all the shots because I can't really do it on a bicycle. I know I look stupid with a helmet on, but hey, you gotta have your safety first. Zach is obsessed with his bike. I'll witness a wreck. Love you. Where are you going? Alright y'all, here's Zach. Uh, he's so cute. He's waiting across the street. Oh, he's waving. Is he not the cutest thing? Go baby, go! Yay! Oh my god, he just stabbed. <laughs> oh, I hope he's careful. Right now, there are fire watches everywhere in California, and I guess they started this new thing where they're gonna shut the power off for like half of California. So we're right in the, literally like a line of fire, yeah, I guess. I mean, we're right in the line of fire. We're gonna go get some supplies, maybe a bucket and pack just like non-perishable food items, some a, water. A bucket? We need to get some sort of like container or something that we can just like pick up and go. we need to like go. shower or something. I'm like freaking out a little bit. It's kind of like, you know, tornado warnings or like whenever snow's coming around. Everybody just gets, you know, canned food, bread, water. So we're going to Target right now. That's what we're going to be doing. And yeah, kind of nervous. Don't know what to expect. Don't know what's going to happen, but... I don't know, it's still scary. It's just new, it's different. We've never experienced anything like this. Like, we're used to severe thunderstorms and tornadoes and things like that. And, you know, snow 
and road closures and stuff, but we're just not used to wildfires. We're at Target, y'all, and we are probably gonna get kicked out for filming, but we'll try to film what we get. But if not, we'll do another Target haul <laughs> for the fire evacuation if there is one. All right, guys, we have made it into the Target, and there's so many people here getting ready for the fire evacuation or power outage, whatever it is. So, what we're doing is we're getting the essentials. Trail mix? You're getting trail, trail mix over the milk chocolate cashews? Yes. Look at this. These, these are essential. Babe, is this part of the essentials? No. <laughs> That's a part of the fire evacuation <laughs> outfit. <laughs> Say hello to my wiener. And so far we got trail mix, toothpaste, and water. And a hot dog soup. And a hot dog soup. <laughs> it's so Sarah Lee. There we go. How about Sarah Lee? Yeah. Yes. Oh, look at that spider. Where? Oh, there's a spider. There's literally a spider. Oh, kill it. Kill it, babe. <laughs> I'm so scared. I'm so startled right now. I think I'm embarrassed in that shit. Alright, guys. I got the paper towels. And I think that's the last item on the list to get into Target. Now we gotta make it out of here alive. You ready, babe? Yep. Alright, let's go. Back in the car. We got our fire. Oh, we forgot a flashlight. Darn it! That's like the main thing because we're not going to have light. You want to see if Walgreens has one? Walgreens is going to be super expensive. Uh, that was like the main reason we went to Target. The main reason we went to Target is for a flashlight, and we ended up getting pumpkin spice pretzels and trail mix. <laughs> everything but a flashlight, pretty much. So. Pretty much everything but fire essentials. Pretty much. Well, we need to go fill up the vehicle in case we do have to evacuate. Yeah. We're gonna go back in Target. <laughs> I'll let you go back to Target. I don't want to go in Target. I don't either. Okay, I'm kind of holding my phone up so y'all can kind of see me. But Zach is in the Target right now. He went back inside to get some flashlights for us and batteries. And after talking to quite a few locals here, I feel much better about this whole fire situation. They said within like the past 25 or so years, they haven't had to evacuate, not once, but like the news just wants you to be prepared. So I think what I'm gonna do is pack some clothes in the suitcase for the next couple of days, just in case we do have to like immediately evacuate. We're not right at the foot of the mountain, um, where we live, but we are close. So, rather be safe than sorry. Um, I, I told a couple of people, a couple of locals, like where we lived and like where in the city we lived, and they were like, "Oh, you're gonna be fine." So, honestly, just depends. But I think I'm gonna pack a suitcase just in case. I've got, um, we've got food ready, water ready, bread. So, um, if anything happens, then. We'll let you guys know, but right now, we're just going to kind of chill out. Okay, Zach's back and he said to take out the vlog, so I don't know what he's going to say. Yeah, I went to the same dude. He's like, did you hear like there was a power outage or something? I was like, yeah, we heard about it, so we're just trying to get prepared. He's like, yeah, I heard a woman come in here earlier saying the same thing. And uh, she was like, I didn't get any flashlights because I got a flashlight on my phone. I was like, that is some good thinking. Yeah, but if your well, phone's anyways. dead, if your phone's dead, then what are we going to do? Well, I asked him that, and he was like, charge it in your car. <laughs> but it's still good to have some just in case, you know? Yep. Yeah. Now we're going to go fill up. He said he, he had never heard anything about that before. About what? Uh, them shutting the power off. Well, I think it's just a prevention. They don't want what happened last year in the Woolsey was it the Woolsey fire that happened last year? The Paradise Cove or whatever? Yeah, or it was one It was one of them, but he, I know that they kept saying that they didn't want... Thousand Oaks, whatever it was. Yeah, they didn't want that to 
happen again. Happen again, so. All right, now we're pulling up to get gas. Oh. Just in case we have to evacuate. Yep. And gas is $4.09 here right now, yeah, that so expensive. that's always fun. <laughs> you having difficulties there? Yeah, I gotta poop. <laughs> okay, that's going in the vlog. That is going in the vlog. Living that California loss. Wow, $45 to fill up my tank, and it was already on half a tank. Jesus gracious. It was a little less than half a tank, but still. Okay, we are back home from our, where did we go? Target excursion at nine o'clock at night. This is what we ended up getting. We ended up getting some flashlights, some body washes in case we have to go to a hotel or anything like that. We just have some extra. The necessities, pumpkin spice pretzels, some bread, and then I'll get out some peanut butter that's in there as well. Paper towels, just in case we have to hit the road. Extra toothpaste, some trail mix, <laughs> a case of waters, and then we also got a pure, I guess, uh, like a filtered water system. So that way, just in case, we could take this with us or whatever. So we got some of that as well. And yeah, that's just about it. I have everything in our closet just in case we have to get it. Hang on, I'll show you guys. So, I put all of our paper, our birth certificates, everything like that in there up there so that way we can just grab it and go and it's kind of stored away just for whatever because i'm a neat freak but right there y'all probably can't see that but i do have our suitcases ready to go that way if there is an emergency we can just grab these up there and then that's on the other side and go so tonight i'm thinking i'm gonna put maybe like our blanket and all of this stuff close to get I don't know okay this is what I'll probably do probably take this bag and fill it with everything that we got and then just keep the waters beside it maybe I'm gonna put everything in this bag and put it in the closet with our suitcases and documents and that way all I would have to grab honestly that's not in the closet is my purse and shampoo conditioner we have a meetup location for if there is a fire while i'm at work or anything like that we have a meetup location at trader joe's and then we have an evacuation plan to go either santa barbara santa maria area or down to san diego Do we leave so, the garage open? and we left the garage open because it's electric and we need a way to get to our car just in case besides the paper towels i got reusable paper towels too so mm. i'm doing a target haul can you like move out of the way sorry babe so yeah that's what we got a target for our fire evacuation if it ends up happening or our wildfire plan thing i don't know what do you call it being prepared our prepared video for a wildfire because they said it can oh, happen. Check out the... I already showed him. You already showed him? Without me? Yeah. It's his favorite part. He loves this pure water filter thing. I'll show. Just because I'm a lovely fiance. Nice. No promo. Well, guys been real like 9 30. We just want to show you guys we are under a fire warning red flag. Not sure what that means yet but I'm learning and they might cut off our power tomorrow so just want to get this video out there. Apartment tour is coming soon. It's in the works but this kind of happened in between so. It's been Zach, Ash, and we're out. Peace. <laughs>